What's up everyone, Arctic here with another Gears of War 3 beta commentary. This is episode number 22, the big 2-2. Two -two. See, I got 22 kills there. We're in the second round, we're picking up. I recorded late, that's why I was standing there late in the spawn. But uh, today, before you guys really get into this commentary, there's a nice shotgun kill right there. I want to let you guys know that uh, off of episode 21 I actually made a thread over on the epic forums the link is down in the description please go over there if you guys support the bomb defusal game type go over there and post in the epic forums just saying you support the thread and uh, any ideas on how you can make it better or some type of one life objective game type that you guys would like to see uh, would be really awesome another shotgun kill on ricochet just getting dominated this round but uh, yeah, that, I just want you guys to check that out. Again, link's down in the description. You can check it out after this video. You can pop it up in another tab, do whatever you gotta do. But uh, go over there and show some love on the Epic Forums. Another nice Lancer kill on that guy. And a shotgun kill, got a quick double. Uh, this gameplay, I am specifically focused on giving you guys some action. I know you guys always say, hey, Arctic's support guy, he doesn't ever take out his shotgun. Well, when I'm in Annex Gameplays or King of the Hill, whatever you want to call it, I like to do work with everything. Uh, this particular game, you guys are going to see I just wallop. Yes, wallop. The other team, there's just no no way you can dispute it. Um, ended up putting up like 10,000 something points. Not my best um, beta a Annex, King of the Hill. I keep wanting to call it Annex, but not my best... Uh, King of the Hill gameplay, but certainly up there with one of the better ones. Uh, and I'm doing a mix of everything. Whenever I play in uh, these types of game types, Annex or King of the Hill, if I'm on Gears 2, I typically try to do it all. Capping the hills, killing people, giving support fire. Here's a nasty play for you guys. There's a quick down, wall bounce, turn around. That was just sick. Now, you guys notice that it's actually 3v4. They have a bot on their team. Uh, again, I picked up late in this because I was just pooping. Yes, pooping on the other team. They just could not hang, and, and two of the guys actually quit out. And I was like, oh, man, I got to record. So that's why I was sitting there standing still at the beginning because I had to hit record because I was just feeling it this particular game. And before I died to Ricochet, who kills me, you know, a couple times, uh, I was actually on like a, what's that, like a 10, maybe 8 or 9 kill streak and I was I think they were almost all shotgun kills but uh, just just going bonkers right now see I got that Lancer down um, this is after the little Lancer update tweak so this is like right towards the end of the beta the Lancer is slightly stronger uh, one more bullet or one less bullet I'm sorry actually downs opponents and um, so you know it's just a good way for me to kind of show you guys that, hey, I, I do shotgun a lot more than Lancer, but I love the Lancer. I just feel like in King of the Hill games specifically, it really, I should have got mantle kick right there. It really uh, kind of helps my team a lot more. Um, and, you know, I don't care about kill stills. I've never been that way. If, if I did, you know, uh, I would probably be yelling and screaming at them, but it's, it's really not that big of a deal to me. Just two seconds late saving that guy right there. Another shotgun kill. But, uh, I mean, I've never been big on, on yelling and screaming about kill steals. It's just uh, not, I don't know. Uh, I, I don't really get into it. I've talked about that in some previous episodes. I think I just saved that guy too. But uh, I'm all about trying to help my team get that dub. And there's another uh, King of the Hill game type where we're going to pick up probably in episode 23 and 24 where I do everything I can and we actually lose the King of the Hill. And I put up another 40 kills, but I wasn't playing quite as uh, well as I was in this game. Kind of missing some shots and, and stuff. So I started off real hot, helped us win the first round, but not so much the second round. There's another nice shotgun head shot on Deadly. He wasn't ready. He's not deadly enough. This is a bot right here. Look at that bot staying alive, doing work. The drone got put out, though. There's another Lancer kill. And I didn't realize that um, damage had the sawed off right there. You know, I kind of backed up as I saw it, but that's one of the reasons. I still don't know how that guy got that kill. It's one of the reasons that Epic is putting that big flashing 
light on the end of the gun so when someone's running up on you with the sawed off they're gonna get dominated no more not knowing that they have it and killing you when you least expect it so keep your eyes glued on the screen when you see someone running at you they more than likely have a sawed off or they're just playing reckless either one got another down there on ricochet and the bot is actually gonna temporarily save his life as he doesn't know what to do right now as you see he's kind of rolling all around there the bot gets away but ricochet decides to poke out and get another lancer down on him this time i'm going to finish the kill i can't remember if he quit or not and he might have but uh i don't know it just didn't matter who i was playing on this particular game there could have been some of my own teammates like skyless or uh cali north could have been on the other team and they would have got dominated so uh i was just in the zone right now and and if it's not apparent then i don't know what to tell you another shotgun kill this is actually on the drone the drone seemed like it had some pretty good movement, like he was trying to get away as much as he could. And I hear that guy behind me, uh, real damage, try to get me with that sawed off. But uh, uh, I was really surprised at the drone's movement when I went back and watched that game. Another kill on Ricochet. Uh, Jackson Tato finished him off there. So what do you guys like? Do you guys like uh, Annex, King of the Hill? I've been playing some more of both game types on um, Gears of War 2, getting ready for Gears of War 3. I don't know if I'm going to post any of those gameplays because Gears of War 2 sucks, but I do have a lot of shotgun gameplay on there. I know people want to see that. There's another down on Deadly. Uh, and, you know, I've been kind of using it as my stepping stone segue into Gears of War 3. We're getting really close now, guys. I mean, it's the last leg i mean i can't wait till september and people are like clamoring every single week that a video comes out and they're like oh three more weeks dead ricochet dead he's gonna get down and and i don't know i'm just really excited oh god what a triple oh that was disgusting and we're about to win this game here but uh yeah i mean the game is approaching if you're not practicing playing i would advise at least suffering through a little bit of gears of war 2 uh, until the game comes out and uh, you know at least getting some movement shotgun work whatever you need to do but uh, this has just been massacre game that I wanted you guys to watch lots of shotgun kills it is obviously 3v4 and I do have 34 downs but if you look at the rest of my team kind of help them win so I uh, wanted to get you guys to see that it's all about that dub and I'll catch you guys later peace